It's Nick's Toho Extravaganza. Okay, so I decided to review all of these separately so I could bitch about them individually. And to get my view count out, but mostly the bitching thing. I gotta say, I think this is one of the worst films I've ever seen. It starts off with the twin fairies being bothered by a bunch of starfish of death. They get some kids to help stop the evil. I guess the parents are just okay with this. And go find a magical underwater pyramid. Oh yeah, they're still shoving environmentalism down our throats with the monster being born from toxic pollution. I guess pollution replaced radiation as the sexy danger. Anyway, the real rotten meat of this movie begins when the kids start exploring the pyramid. They get lost, bicker, complain, and take up most of the damn movie, just like before. What the hell?! Oh yeah, and there's a little Gremlins reject that comes in later in the film, I almost forgot. There's another subplot about the evil fairy sister manipulating some guys into tearing up the temple looking for treasure. So, it's a race between the kids and the adults on who will find the treasure first while the monsters duel outside. The one redeeming facet of this film is Degarla, who's okay at best. He's really more of a Power Rangers reject than a Toho monster. I even heard a rumor he was recycled from an old Space Godzilla costume. It is kinda cool to see Mothra change into her different forms from General Mothra to Rainbow Mothra to Aqua Mothra, but they aren't anything special. Oh, and there's some cheesy Power of Friendship theme at the end. If you're interested in seeing this or the first movie, they were released on a DVD double pack. The third one has never received an American release, DVD or otherwise, which is a shame because it was the best-ish one. I mean, it couldn't be any worse than this, right? Oh,